you know, there's this renewed interest in like the uh, 2K emo and pop punk sound, and uh, you guys are certainly part of that and certainly part of the history of that. But I think, uh, Patrick, you had said in an article that uh, you weren't necessarily embraced by that scene fully. Well, at I, the j time. I just mean that, you know, okay, so Chicago had a, a thriving and very defined emo scene. And by that, I mean like, I mean like Midwest emo was a thing, right? So when we started, we weren't that, and none of none of the bands now that get called emo were that, and we all knew that. Like it wasn't like we were all different. That we were like a hardcore band that played pop punk or something. I don't really know what we called ourselves. We didn't have a name for it, um, and em emo existed, and wasn't mean to us, but they weren't like you know. I also think that we like weren't trying to enter into that scene. We yeah. kind of created our own scene out in the. The, the suburbs and just played at whatever. We would just play until a fire marshal would show up, basically. <laughs> that was like kind of the rule of the, the, yeah. the, sh the early shows. And it was, and we've talked about it with this this record. There's like a bit of uh, Field of Dreams as you build it, they will come. Like you, and I, and I really mean this for anybody who's playing music or making art. Like you just got to get out and like make it and create it and find other people that are like minded and like make your own scene. That's like what it is, you know what I mean? And it's less about like, not being a part of someone else's and just kind of creating your own universe. Well, and I guess what I was trying to say, tying into that, what I was what I was trying to say is that there really wasn't a scene to be a part of at the time, you know. So like now, so I think in retrospect, it's very easy to say like, oh, all these bands were a thing, but it's like at the time, you know, we were kind of just figuring it out. You know, we were right. just kind of making it up as we went along. You know. Well, I think now it's more of I think maybe fifteen, almost twenty years ago, it was like one lane or the other. Like you were either this kind of band or this kind of band. Yeah, we were and never that. No. You know what I mean? Like no, we were just like that's like people are like, why is Jay Z on the record? Or why right. you know like why are you working with the guy that did? Why like did you do a song with White Club? Yeah, pretty and awesome I, song. And it's just kind of how we we have really interest different tastes and we have really different influences and so I, I love like because I, I'll see my kids listening to music now and it's just like kind of all over the place. They yeah, just it's fluid. Li yeah, and they like what yeah. they like and it's less yeah. about like this is this genre and this is and and it's. Really cool. It's really cool to see. Yeah. Brian and Justin in the morning and Chicago's alternative all day. Q101.